Hello, my lucky stars, and thank you for coming in. Today we have another fantastic seafood boil along with some lemon water. And I would like for five, at least five of the lucky stars before you leave this video, give me a suggestion of something that you would like to see me eat in the next video. And this is today's seafood boil. So I have some crab, corn, okra, sausage, potatoes, and shrimp. And I'm quite hungry. I had a diet drink this morning before I went to the, no, after I went to my uh, exercise se session. I think that's pretty awesome. I can't wait to eat it. Eat it! Start off. With, oh, I want to show you guys, those of you who were interested, this one king crab that I have right there, one king crab was $16.20, the price for each pound, it was $39.99 per pound, and for this, Crab leg, it was $16. I'm thinking that's focusing properly, and I'm hoping that it's focusing pro properly. For the snow crab that you see, it was um, $10.99 per pound, and all those snow crab came to a grand total of $10.06. So that's what I paid for that. I did get the shrimp from Walmart and the bag was less than $10 for all the shrimp that you see in here. And I said I was going, oh Lord have mercy. I said I was going to start with the crab, but I want to get to chewing on something and it's going to take a minute to get into that crab. And this is going to be, I thought I bought some dipping sauce in here. I'll be right back. lost my dipping sauce okay that's weird that is really really weird I even looked in the refrigerator and it's not in the refrigerator so um, I gotta calm myself down because I get too excited and um, it's not on this table where else could it be That's weird. I'm glad I put something on the, in this in this tray because. Mm. The sauce is everything. Every, every, everything. So this is that one $16.99 -er that I told you about. Forgot to bring the scissors. Also known as kitchen shears. Forgot to bring those. And of course, well that one came out easily enough. I 
can figure out what I did with the um with the dipping sauce. <clears throat> and I would think that it would be right there in plain view. Mm. This corn is so sweet. Mmm. Before I came to the camera, I saw a video on the national news, not the YouTube news, not the gossipy news, the national news. And it was showing a video of Diddy beating up Cassie Ventura in the hallway of a hotel. So if anybody didn't believe it, it looks like they got the proof. Mm. We're going to slowly and calmly walk in the kitchen and see if I can find the dipping sauce. for reminding me. Now that's a perfect example of how it is when people are getting old and they forget what they do. Oh, the word of the day. But Ruth replied, don't urge me to leave you or to turn back from you. Where you go, I will go. And where, I, where you stay, I will stay. Your people will be my people. And your God, my God. That's Ruth 116, New International Version. That's one of my favorites. Where you go, I will go. Where your people go. Uh, where you stay, I will stay. And I want to shout out a great big thunderous thank you shout out to um hold on can you see the sauce now shout out to um a bite of life is giving me awesome 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 comments mmm Mm hmm A bite of life. <clears throat> Thank you. Mm.
I'm not going to stay long because Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Do you hear that blinking noise? That beeping noise? That means I left the refrigerator open. Refrigerator can tell me I left it open. Why couldn't the uh, microwave tell me my sauce was in there? Why? I me mean, running around looking like an old idiot. Shout. I'm getting too fat. Mm, it's about time to end this video. the scissors. Now what can I do to get this out of here? I didn't bring the, the pickers or the scissors. So I'm going to get them. For the one person that's still here, One person that's still here and wants to see me open some more crab. Will you forgive me while I go get the scissors and <clears throat> the pickers and I need to rinse my hands really quickly. So, I'll be back. Y'all say hello to one another while I'm gone.
Don't let the quiet get you down. Just consider it an intermission in which I didn't turn off the I didn't turn off the I didn't turn off the camera. Thank you for waiting for me. You're so kind and gentle. Thank you. <clears throat> Excuse me, please. Butter sauce. My brother took me to see the Isley Brothers on Saturday. And the show was so good. Mm, it was awesome. Now when I get in the car, the car wanted to keep playing Isley Brothers songs for me. I forgot to get the scissors out of the package while my hands were clean. So now I'm going to have to wash the package as well. But it's okay. So... Hopefully I can get some good suggestions about what I could eat. You know, what I really want to get, I want to have, ouch, I want to have some church's chicken. But the church's chicken is kind of far away from here. And then, I'm going to have to wash this blouse when I finish. But the church's chicken is kind of far. It's about 30 minute drive. And then by the time I get back home, the chicken is only going to be so warm, so I might have to warm it up. But it's not the warming up that bothers me, it's the driving. I don't like to drive. I will come back and do another mukbang with this crab, but 
I know y'all getting tired of me eating crab. Mmm, so good. Fascinating. I guess I'll stop. Later on tonight, I'll go and get me some more. <laughs> I forgot to do 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 do. Mmm. Absolutely. Smackalicious. Mmm. Mmm. One more bite. Oh, um, there's a piece of whole gar a whole garlic clove right there. If you can see that, going in for the garlic clove. I melted in my mouth. Mmm. So worth it after all. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, sweet thing. Now who knew that Chaka Khan has a new perfume out? And it comes in a bottle that's shaped like a microphone, a golden microphone. And I want to try it, but I don't want to spend the money. <laughs> so I'm not going to get it. <laughs> First, I wanted to try it. I was thinking I might get it, you know. But it's a unisex scent. And I think unisex scents smell masculine. So they might smell good, but I don't want to smell masculine. I want to smell fruity or flowery like a female, like a woman, a girly girl. That's what I want. That's what I like. So I'm going to pass on that. And I was thinking maybe I'll just get the cocoa butter um, <clears throat> version of, of it because that's only $35. But then after you pay the shipping fee, it's probably going to be $45. So... I said, I don't have no $45 to be, just in case I don't like it. Mmm. So, however, It is getting rave reviews. Mm. So it probably smells really good, you know. But if it smells really good and it really smells like a man, that's not for me. 
I think now that this is very important. Not to be ambiguous. Unless you want to be ambiguous. <laughs> if you want to smell like a man, smell like a man. If you want to smell like a lady, smell like a lady. I just... I'm going on another no spend month where I'm not just buying stuff all frivolous and willy nilly, getting things that I need, not things that I want or that I think I might like. Excuse me, please. Oh, the water, the water, the water. Let's get one more sip and say goodbye. I can feel the lemon absorbing the butter as it translates and travels out of my digestive system. Mm. Until we meet again. Happy meals to you all. Roger that.